having the same nightmare ever since I woke up here in Cursed Hollow. And I need to do something to clear my mind. I think that calls for mining and fishing. Don't you think? Let's go. I've heard there's all kinds of metals down in these mines if you're brave enough to dig them out. I've heard there's also all kinds of spooky things. What's this? Platinum? Such a pretty color. Ooh. We'll get that up out of here. And we'll keep on going. Oh, there we go. Start over here and see what we can find. We go straight this way. Gotta focus on the pickaxe. No bad dreams, only the pickaxe. Doing something productive with our area. Hopefully we'll settle in soon enough. More platinum and a little bit of iron. That'll help. Get that all out of here. I'm not quite sure what it does, but I'm sure we can figure it out. I mean, at the very least, it's a pretty color, right? Get the iron. Oh, almost forgot this one. I'm going to fill this hole back in just so that it looks better once we're done here. And keep on going. Gotta stay focused on this pickaxe. That way, we're not focused on the bad dream. I'm not entirely sure what the dream even means. You will walk these halls forever. It certainly felt real and terrifying. Oh, can't focus on that now. Lapis. I think we'll need this for enchanting, so it's probably good that we found some. Some coal. That'll help us light everything up and help us burn in our furnaces. Make sure we get all that out. Not entirely sure what this black ore is down to the side, but we'll get all this coal and then we'll figure it out. Hmm. Running out of space. Finish up here and maybe I'll have to make a trip to a chest and empty things out. Stay focused on what we're doing at hand and not let the fear take over. Hopefully this is the last little bit in this section. There we go. Alright. Oh yeah, the black ore. I wonder what that is. Watrolum? I don't know what that does, but it looks interesting. There we go. Oh, running out of space again. I'm definitely going to need to go empty things out soon. There we go. Soapstone. Sure is dark. Get all this out of the way. More coal. Oh, what's this? There's so much coal here. I guess the more the merrier, right? Some more iron. This is starting to feel like it just goes on forever. 
we are running low on torches. And I guess if we're going to be in this cave, we're going to need them. There we go. That's better. Get this iron here. And we'll see if we can't do some more exploring. More iron. We need all of it that we can get right now, though. There we go. That way looks dark. We'll go this way. Dripping water. I wonder what that's from. Let's stop and get this really quickly. What is that? An orange mushroom. Huh. Some gold. Never have too much gold, especially when it's the only kind of armor you can wear. There we go. Let's see if I can get down here. Almost had a run in with a scary. Keep going this way. Can't touch the water. Oh. All right, we'll go back this way. More kite. It's beautiful. More iron. Always helpful, I guess. Platinum. By the time we get out of here, we're going to have quite the haul, don't you think? silver, but you never know. It might come in handy. Too bad I can't take those mushrooms, though. I'm curious if they would be good for anything later down the line. I've heard that the stuff around here is always good for something. There's flowers and mushrooms and all kinds of things provided to us from nature. got quite the haul. This is an alloy forgery. We wait for the lava to drip down into that cauldron. Now I'll use coal until we're done. And we put everything in here and it smelts it all down. There are certain metals that mix, but I haven't quite figured all that out yet. But this is how we'll make our armor and our tools and all kinds of other things. Iron, mithril, copper, silver, platinum, lapis goes with us in the house, manganese, auriculum, morkite.
It smelts it down pretty fast, too. Oh, see, now the lava's full that we used all our coal. Well, now that we've got everything done in the mines, I think it's time for us to go do some fishing. I think that'll top the night off well. I think part of the reason I've been having these nightmares is I, I just don't feel like I quite fit in here. I don't feel like I'm at home. And I'm not sure if I should feel like I'm at home. I think we have to adjust to this new home and to what, what we need to change into. I think this is a journey about becoming something different. And that has to be okay. Oh, what is that? You, you see it under the tree there? I'm not sure what that is. Hello? Oh, that's much bigger than I thought it was. Hello? Well, he hasn't attacked us. I think he's friendly. You look like you're feeling out of place, too. That's okay. I feel out of place. Maybe we could be out of place together. Let's get you away from this zombie. I'll take you home, where we'll make you a home of your own. Oh, we gotta go the other way. Yeah, there you go. We'll put you here for right now. And I'll go in, and I'll get you a name tag. decide to name you hmm spectacle or spec for short I like the way that spec and dot sound together there we go now oh it's dark outside I'm gonna sleep really quickly and then we'll go name tag There we go. Let's run this out there. Sir Spectacle the Great. Dot's noble and trusted steed. Well, thanks guys for coming along with my adventures today. Mining and fishing and finding Sir Spec. I hope you guys all like and subscribe if you are enjoying the series so far and we'll see you guys all next time on mystica smp